get to our plays of the night. We'll show you four plays that stood out the most this week, and then you can decide the winner. It's our plays of the night. And how about play one? Sullivan quarterback Rowdy Adams, we just saw this earlier, finds his receiver Grant Bell for a long touchdown pass. This play would help the Golden Arrows on their way to a big victory tonight over Princeton. Bell had three receptions in this game, and two would go for touchdowns. How about play two? Terre Haute North facing Decatur Central. The Patriots' Chase Russell rolls out. It's Damon Sturm for a touchdown. Sturm's teammates would celebrate with him in the end zone, Dimitri. Now play number three, South Vermillion's Anthony Garzellini winds up and throws a deep strike to senior receiver Thomas Brooks. This play would go for a Wildcat touchdown. What a beautiful pitch and catch by both players there. And how about play four? West Vigo's Caleb Mars hits his receiver, Deshaun Lowe, and Lowe would do the rest. He goes up the sideline while making a few defenders miss on his way to the end zone. What a show of speed and playmaking ability by Lowe to stay in bounds and score. And of course, you guys know what to do, right? Head to our website, mywabashvalley.com, and vote for which play you think is our play of the night for this week. Voting is open all weekend, and we'll announce the winner Monday right here on WTWO.